Greetings in the name of Jesus Christ. Today's thought is from from the book of Daniel, chapter one, verse eight. Daniel chapter one, verse eight. But Daniel purposed in his heart that he would not defile himself with the portion of the king's deliciousness, nor with the wine which he drank. Therefore, he requested of the chief of the eunuchs that he might not defile himself. Here we see another good quality of Daniel's life. Bible says Daniel purposed in his heart not to defile with the king's food. So he requested the leader of the eunuchs to give them different food. Daniel was a, a prisoner in that country. But still he had a divine courage to separate himself from the worldly things. He purposed in his heart not to defile himself. There was a choice before Daniel, but he took a right decision in his choice. He did not compromise with the worldly things. Today, the Lord is expecting such a heart from our life also. There are many choices before us. But the Lord wants us to separate ourselves from the worldly things. The Lord wants us to live for Him. In our decision making, we need to make a right decision. It should bring glory to God. Daniel's life brought a glory to God in everything. Decision making, in his lifestyle, everything he brought glory to God. Shall we ask the Lord to give us the same grace? to take a right choice and to take a stand for the Lord. Let's pray. Dear Lord Jesus, thank you for showing Daniel's life as an example for us. Lord, help us to take a right decision. Help us to take a good stand for you, Lord. Lord, we should not compromise with the worldly things. We should not defile ourselves with the worldly things. Help us to please you, Lord. Help us to live for you. We need your grace. We need your courage. We need your strength. We need your wisdom. With our own strength, we cannot take a right decision, Lord. We need, we need your strength, Lord. Let this day be a day of miracle for your children. Touch them, bless them, encourage them. Let your name alone be glorified. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. God bless you. Have a wonderful day. Amen.